Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I thought I would do like my weekly coloring update or recap or whatever you want to call it that I'm trying to keep up with. Um, I haven't done hardly any coloring at all. Um, I mentioned before we rented um, some movies from our local video store. We had 30 days of um, half off rentals. So we've been trying to catch up on everything that we missed at the theater and um, some shows that were available for rent that we wanted to see. So we have been renting a lot of stuff and watching it in the evenings, and that's when I would normally do my coloring. So I only got a very, very small amount of coloring done. Um, I have some new books and journals and uh, washi tape to show you, but I did color a very small amount in my journal. And when I say a very small amount, <laughs> I'm serious, it's a very small amount. But um, I thought I would show it to you. Now, I do have part of it covered up because I don't want... There's some personal stuff on this page. <laughs> so I'm going to zoom in. Actually, which way do I zoom? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. There we go. Um, I did color. I stuck these two stickers on there, and then I colored a little background around them. Um, <clears throat> and uh, that's all I did. That's it. That's all I did. I just used... What did I use? What pencils did I use? Oh, ink tents, but I didn't water act activate them. I just used, um, just used them dry. And that's all I did. <laughs> I just felt like coloring one night and I didn't really know what I wanted to color. So then I had stuck these two stickers down and I was like, oh, I'll just color around them. So, so that's that. That's all I colored like in a week. Crazy, huh? So let me zoom now back out. I can't, what's going on with my camera? There we go. Okay. And I will show you guys the new stuff that I have. So my friend sent me this book. Um, I got it yesterday. It is a coloring book and I'm zoomed out as far as I, let me see. My camera is precarious in the tripod today. I don't know what the deal is with it. I don't know if it's the way I have it positioned or what, but anyways, so she sent me this coloring book that is absolutely fabulous. I don't know what it's called <laughs> because it's completely not in English, but it's like a vintage fas fashion book and I love vintage vintage fashion. It's utter utterly, utterly, it's utterly fantastic. Um, I'm so pleased with it. It has a dust jacket and that's the cover on the inside there. But it's so beautiful and I'm almost like, I don't know what to do because I don't want to color in it because it's so pretty. But it has like, um, some of it's already colored in, like the skin on a lot of them is colored in. And then on this page, there's like another image that's already done with text. And there's some color palettes with stuff I have no idea what that is and um like here is the image colored and then there it is blank it's just it's such a gorgeous gorgeous book I love it and I'm like so torn I want to get another copy of it right away because I want to in a way I want to cut some of the images out to be able to put them in a journal but in the other way I just want to leave it alone so I was like well if I have two then I can <laughs> then I can do that and it's just it shows like how you can do different coloring and I don't know it's fantastic and I love it I absolutely love it I am so utterly charmed by it that it's ridiculous and then the other thing I got it came yesterday <clears throat> was this colorist special effects book by Helen Elliston this book was really popular in the Facebook groups, um, a while ago, everybody was coloring in it. And I know there's two, two, <coughs> excuse me, two volumes of this. And so, um, I got the first one and I really, really am glad I did, especially for the, um, the, like the gemstones. I really, really, really want to be able to use the, and the, uh, like the Hannah Carlson books with the crystals and just, you know, oh my gosh, so much stuff, you know, like the bugs and everything. So really, really, really excited to have this. Um, I got, look at the balloons, how pretty they are. And they make it seem very easy to learn how to do this. So I'm really excited to try some of these techniques. And, um, I got it last night. We were gone all day long. We went to my mom's to a, um, and then we went to a benefit dinner. We took her, um, to a benefit dinner for a woman that, um, I went to my high school and she is donating a kidney to somebody on Friday. And the surgery is really a lot harder on the person that donates the kidney than the one that is receiving the kidney. So she'll be off of work, I think for two months recovering. So they're having like a benefit dinner for her. And, um, we went to that 
And then when we got home, it was like 9.30 at night, and this was waiting for me because it had come in the mail, and I'm like, I just want to color right now <laughs> because it's so cool, you know. It really made me excited. Um, so I'm really looking forward to that. And then a few days ago, I got some new journals. I put them on Facebook. I know I don't need any new journals, but I wanted one in particular, and I went, it wasn't available at Michael's online. They said it was in-store only. It was sold out online. And I had to deliver some Avon to somebody, and um, I was like, okay, after I deliver this, I'm going to go swing by Michael's and get that. And so they had the one I went there for, but then I saw all these other ones that were really cute, and Keith was like, just get them all. Who cares? <laughs> Because he knows I've really been enjoying my journaling. So this one is the one I wanted um, that was online. It says Mermaid at Heart, and it has the mermaid scales on it. Um, it's kind of foiled like that. And this is, again, more of those everyday value journals like I held before. They're $5 a piece at Michael's. I just really, really, really love them. Um, the one I colored in or that I showed when the video first started is also from that line. And they're very... I don't know. I just like the way they feel and they, they hold up nice and they take up gel pen really good. And so this one um, had Little Mermaids on the inside cover and the bookmark in it is a green. So yeah, I just, I really, really wanted this one. So I definitely got that. It's so adorable. And then um, I grabbed this one because they have one of a unicorn riding a bicycle and it says be right back off to dream or something like that but but I saw this one and I'm like okay this one has flowers and unicorns and hearts like and clouds with smiley faces in them so and rainbows I mean come on who can resist that <laughs> and the um inside is red and it has the uh like a golden kind of bookmark in it and then this one says to the moon and back on it um everybody loves that expression i love you to the moon and back but i i really love it and so i wanted that the interior is like a navy blue and the bookmark in it is a navy blue also uh and then the last one i got is so cute the llama wearing sunglasses and it says nope and it's so funny because today i am wearing a sweatshirt that says nope and i have a hat a winter hat that says nope like that is one of my favorite things ever because that's just how I feel about pretty much everybody these days well not everybody but like all the nonsense that goes on on television on the news on the social media I'm just like nope not dealing with that nope not even gonna entertain the notion nope shut her down before I even begin <laughs> that's how I feel so I just love this and they also have um little pencil cases that match this. They were up by the checkout line, but I didn't pick one up. Um, they have some different pencil cases that match the $5 journals that are back there in the journal aisle. So that was pretty cool. Um, and then the inside is just kind of like this beigey yellow shade. And then the um, bookmark in it is white. But I thought that was really, really cute. And then the last thing I got is I ordered them a long time ago, um, but they, they came from China. They took a while. I got them on eBay, and they're washi tape, but they are, um, and I can zoom in on these because they're small. Oh, wrong way, as usual. They are Van Gogh um, washi tapes, so they're based off of different Van Gogh paintings. And I like that the box matches the tape, but I'll take... Here's another one. You can look at that one while I take this out of the box. So you can see, I'll show you guys what, like, what the tape looks like. Um, they took a long time to come, and I can list the seller. If he, if the seller still has these available in their eBay store, I can link them in the description section. So here is like the one tape. I mean, you don't really get the whole sense of the painting in the washi tape, but still, I like Van Gogh, or Van Gogh, however you want to say, and um, I I just really like the idea of having those. So I got various ones here. There's that one. I know this one is like the Haystacks. I'll show you guys that one too. I can take that out of the box. This one's kind of scrunched up in the box. It's like bent. I really, really like washi tape, so I got, okay, so that's the haystacks. Um, I'm not sure what this one is exactly. I don't know the names of all these paintings, I'll be honest with you guys. I know some of them. I know 
you know, some of them I know. I used to know a lot more. Um, I had a lot of art history in college, and but some of them, I'll be honest, the names elude me. Oops, sorry. That's pretty. And then we've got, um, this one is really pretty, and I don't know the name of that one. Oops, sorry. That one. Oops. Hold on. I slid behind my printer, and I don't want that to happen. But I think this one's really pretty. Come on. Come out of the little box. Well, you guys, it doesn't want to come out of the box. There we go. Very, very pale. You know, like very, very light. Um, sorry. Pastel, you know, type shades. Um, so here's this one also. Right there. And then, of course, I got Starry Night. How could you not get Starry Night? And I was a little disappointed that the Starry Night ones don't look exactly like, you know, they're not like, you can't take a look at them and go, oh, this is Starry Night. <laughs> you know what I mean? But let me open it and I'll show it to you guys. But, you know, you can't win them all, right? I mean, you can kind of tell that it is. Kind of. Kind of, maybe a little bit, <laughs> but still, if you're interested, I will leave the link to that seller if they still have them listed um, in their eBay store. So, so yeah, just some, just some washi tapes and some random doodads uh, this week. But that's all I have going on. I, so like I said, I didn't really color very much except for in my journal. But um, I just wanted to touch base with you guys because I said I really want to keep coloring content on my channel um, on a regular basis, even if it's not as much as I used to have. And if I color this week, which hopefully I will, um, I will let you guys know what it is or maybe film or do something. I don't know. But anyways, Deborah Muller has three new books coming out soon. I hope that they are all released like within the next week but they are all going to be fantastic and I really 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 want them um all three of them are faces books like faces and hair so there's like now I can't remember the exact titles so don't quote me on this but there's one with fairies there's one with queens and then there's one with mermaids so the fairies is supposed to be basically a follow-up to fairy hair fairy hair crowns and shoes um so there's a fairy face and hair book. Then there's a queen's one, and it's got crowns, like uh, faces and hair, and the, every image is wearing crowns uh, or a crown. And then she has a mermaid crowns one, too, or a mermaid faces, mermaid hair, or something like that. All three of them I want. I want, I want, I want. I want so much crap stuff. <laughs> I just feel like I'm always wanting something. But, yeah. So that's what I have going on. Um, as soon as those books come out, though, I, I probably will be purchasing them. I know I always get the PDF, but those I think I want in, like, the regular book form. So so be on the lookout for those. I'll probably share them. When she releases them, I'll share it on my Facebook page. And, of course, if you're in our group, you'll know about it because there'll be flip-throughs posted and everything like that. And then when I actually get my hot little hands on the actual book itself, I will do um, flip-throughs flip then, too. But, all right, you guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.